Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the White Oak, Pennsylvanian toy collector, and it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people, and it is some more scariest figures. Woo! And I just love doing that scary voice just for the sake of Halloween. Why not? <laughs> because we got some figures of fright. It's a figures, not a fright, pretty much. First on the list, we got this Stitch vampire from Lilo and Stitch the movie when he dressed up in that costume. Being a little vampire, being like, Yeah, yeah. Increase game, blah, blah, blah. That's my Stitch impression, you know what I mean? And that's all there is to say for Stitch. There ain't much about him. He's a plush. Next on the list, we got the girl from, you guessed it, The Nightmare Before Christmas. And I have never had a plush or figure of this character. And she's the Frankenstein girl. She's got a like for Jack. And yeah, I think they could easily be a couple in their own right, if you know what I mean. Halloween couple, if you get what I'm saying. Next on the list, we got this super old Halloween plush. I think someone made this completely, or it's an older one I know nothing about, but he's like a little monster Frankenstein or zombie, if you want to be specific, but he is kind of cute. I like some cute Halloween plushes. Why not? Rawr, I'm going to get you, junk. You know what I mean? That's what monsters say, basically. Next, we got Mavis from Hotel Transylvania. And this, and she was always a cute-looking vampire girl from the cartoon. Sorry if I had to correct myself a little bit there. But yeah, she was a cute-looking vampire girl that fell in love with a human. Why not? Dare I say why not? That's why I picked her up. Next on the list, we got this scary video game character. It used to be a noisemaker, but I think the batteries have long since been dead on this guy. And they no longer works. Might have been damaged. Who knows? So otherwise, this guy is gruesome looking. He's kind of like a cookie monster. But instead of a friendly cookie monster face, you got a scary face of terror. Why not? he give my dog Teddy nightmares. I'd say that for sure. <laughs> and last but not least, we got this little plastic skeleton dinosaur with no posability. Why not? Yeah, I say why not. And I knew this was going to be a quick review. Because it's just plush figures. They don't do much. But if you like this video, please make sure to like. Please make sure to comment, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on, and rock on, and rock out, YouTube land.